Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to grab any of the Google Map 3D models, Google Map 3D buildings and import into your Autodesk Maya in any of your 3D modeling or 3D animation project in your Autodesk Maya. So let's go through step by step. What you need to do is you just need to scroll down, go to the video descriptions and download the Google Map 3D Grabber version 2 from here. This is my download link, this is my Google Drive download link. You can just give a click. You should be able to download a zip file. After you download a zip file, you extract it. Then you should be able to get three objects. First you download, oh sorry, first you install the render dot 1.7. Install the render dot in your computer. <coughs> And you also go and install the Google Chrome. Make sure you have the Google Chrome. If you already installed the Google Chrome, you have the Google Chrome shortcut. All these Google Chrome shortcuts are provided by me. You just need to double click in. So you can see, if you are using the 32 bit of the Google Chrome, you, you should use this shortcut. If your window tense is 64 bits, then you should use this Google Chrome 64 window dot. Use this shortcut that I provided for you. I copy and paste. Control C to copy and I paste it on my desktop. This is the Google Chrome render dot that I already created for you. Next. Once you already install the render dot, <clears throat> first thing what you are going to do is start the render dot. After you start the render dot, click File, Inject into Process. Next, type a Chrome at here, C H R O M E, and it's here. Click Refresh. Next, what you are going to do is start the Google Chrome render dot shortcut that I provided for you. Double click in. Now you can see this is a white white color white color zone it never show you anything but you, you still can make it big or small and you can see a conversation box here next step is refresh here you should be able to see a Google Chrome CPU click Google Chrome CPU and click inject next come back to the Google Chrome conversations click OK at here now now it's your time to go to the Google Map. Map.google.com. Okay, enter. You can go and find your your Google Map. <clears throat> Let's say I search New York City or I search Paris, France. Go to the Paris. I want to grab some of the some of the three buildings. Let's say I want to grab. Okay, what is this? This is the Alpha Tower. Alpha Tower. Click the satellite here. It will become a 3D. 3D view. Now, now it is in 3D. And then you should be able to see a 3D button here. Click the 3D button. Now, the Alpha Tower is in 3D. Next step. Go back to your render dot. The capture after delay, here you choose 5. That means once you click capture after delay, it will wait for 5 seconds. Once you click capture after delay, you have to come back here and keep on dragging, keep on drag at here. And after that, you should be able to see one capture safe. It automatic countdown for 5 seconds. Then it will automatically save it as RDC file. <clears throat> now you can close you can close it already or you can leave it. For now I will close it. Okay, for this one, this is the render dot file. What I'm going to do is click file, save capture as 
As demo, I will save on my desktop. I right click and open a new folder. This is Alpha Tower. Okay, enter double times. And I give a file name Alpha Tower. Then I click save. Save as RDC file. I save it. Now, check with that folder. You should be able to see this is an RDC file. Now you can close the render doc already. Next. Go back to the Google Map 3D Gravel version 2. Open the folder. You should be able to see a Blender 2.90 inside here. I already installed the, the free plugin for you. Double click in and start the Blender here. Once you start the Blender, delete these three objects. The camera, the cube and the light. Press delete buttons to delete everything. And now, go to the edit, preferences. Go to the add-on, and here you search map, M-A-P. Make sure you take here, import, export, maps, model, importer. Make sure you take here, next. Click file, import. You can see Google Map Capture dot RDC. Okay. Choose it. As demo, I already saved the RDC file on my desktop. The folder name is Alpha Tower, and the RDC file is the Alpha Tower dot RDC. Double click in. Here, at here you show not responding, but you just need to be patient and wait for a while. Actually, it is loading. Do not close it. Just need to wait for a while. Now you can see, it should not responding, but actually it is working. Now, the texture is not loaded yet. You have to click here to turn on the texture. And this is really a Paris city. And what you are going to do is, you select everything in this way, and press Ctrl Z to make sure to make sure all the meshes will combine to, to become one. Next, what you are going to do is export it as FBX file. As demo, I will export it on my desktop. Click File, Export, FBX file. And remember, the path mode you have to choose copy. And here, you have to click it to make sure you embed the texture. And as demo, I will save it on my desktop. I will name it Alpha Tower. Export FBX. And wait for a while until the FBX file appear at here. Okay, now you can see the FBX file is already exported. And I also will save the Blender file as a backup file, save as. I'll save it as backup on the desktop. I will name it Alpha Tower. And save as. Okay, next I can close it. Close the Blender. You can see 
the FBX bar is already success successfully exported here. If I double click the FBX bar, it will open with the 3D viewer in window 10 and you can preview it. Now, you see, this is the Paris city and the Alpha Tower. And this is the FBX file that you can import into any of your 3D modeling and 3D animation software. Now I close this. All right, next, you can open your Autodesk Maya. This is Maya 2019. I'm going to show you how to import into Autodesk Maya. It is pretty easy. Just a quick demo here. Alright, what you need to do to import into the Autodesk Maya, you just need to drag in, drag in the FBX file to the center and release your mouse. Now it is importing the FBX file into the Maya and wait for a while, it is processing and now you can see. Okay, I move it up a bit. Okay, now, this is the Google Map 3D with all the meshes. And now I want to show all the texture, I just click here. Now you can see, the Paris City, the Paris City and the Alpha Tower now is available in Autodesk Maya. And you can create your 3D animation, 3D modeling, etc. in your Autodesk Maya. That, that is pretty cool. You can add a background as well. All right, that's all for today about how to grab any of the 3D models from Google Map 3D and import into your Autodesk Maya for your 3D animation and your 3D modeling. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my ne next video. Enjoy happy animation and game developing. See you.